And Gama Mara has implemented this magnificent shamba. It's a sustainable vegetable garden, which means that the lodge does not buy any of its fresh produce from stores, but rather grows it here on site completely sustainably. The first seedling was planted in April of 2016. With hard work and determination, what was a simple idea has become a flourishing source of nourishment. The idea of the shamba came about because the lodge is so remote and far away from a big city that they needed a supply of fresh produce. The design of the shamba is um, inspired by the game of snakes and ladders. So the idea is that there's five different zones within the garden and guests can either decide to walk straight between the five different zones or they can take the meandering labyrinth path. In Son, two, in Son 1, we planted the families of pumpkins like uh, cucumbers, baby marrow, watermelons. In Son 2, we have the companion like leeks, we have uh, red acras, brinjals, corianders, cauliflower, we have uh, broccoli. Most of the vegetables go to the kitchen, up the kitchen. Those Moses uses their kitchen every day, all the time. Not only was were we focusing on designing a beautiful vegetable garden, but we were interested in helping the lodge to become a zero waste facility, um, and so doing, creating building materials um, such as eco bricks, using plastic um, waste and plastic bottles. Um, and using some of those materials to build raised bed vegetable gardens to demonstrate that um, upcycling can lead to great benefits. The no waste policy benefits the environment, the local people, and of course, the guests. Making this magnificent shamba the center of Angama's sustainable network. It's incredible when you design something and it comes out better than what you anticipated it could. A big highlight of my experience has been working with the people of Angama. Um, it's such a delight to work with people who love what they do. They really are proud of it and they deserve to be proud because their work has been phenomenal. Are you addicted to Africa? Well, click subscribe and you can stay hooked to all the wild moments. If you still can't get enough, click on the little bell and you'll be notified for your daily dose of live safari.